updates on health and wellness. So today we are going to explore an interesting homeopathic medicine that is Aurum Muraticum Natronatum. We will discuss about its origin, uses and benefits it can offer. So watch this video till end for more knowledge and stay connected with us for more informative videos like this. So let's talk about Aurum Mur Natronatum. So this medicine is prepared from a combination of gold chloride that is Aurum Muraticum and sodium chloride that is Natrum Muraticum. So through a series of dilutions and succussions, homeopathic medicine preparations involve a unique process which is known as potentization in which highly diluted substances are energetically potentized to increase their healing qualities. It's used and is used to address various physical and emotional health issues. This remedy is known for its effectiveness in treating conditions which are related to cardiovascular system, mental health and hormonal imbalance. Now next, we'll talk about the constitution and personality of Aurum Neutronatum. So it is a complex homeopathic medicine. And the element natrum is related to the concept of love relationship and its primary conflict are related to a love relationship such as betrayal in love, disappointment in love and death of any loved one and grief in love relationships. Whereas the element Muraticum is related to the feeling of disappointment. The element Aurum is related to the great care and responsibility with the insecurities in a love relationship. So Aurum Neutronatum is a suitable medicine for the patient who have carbonatrogenous and mercurial syphility constitutions. Now next we'll talk about the clinical indications of Aurum Neutronatum. This medicine can be used for acne, alopecia, headache, Hectic fever, ascites, carcinoma, uterine prolapse, uterine fibroid, uterine tumors, ovarian cyst, UTI, that is urinary tract infection, constipation, diarrhea, piles, or you can say hemorrhoids, warts, metarrhagia, amenorrhea, and lycoria. Now, in order to make it understandable to you people, now one by one, I will be explaining each and every clinical indication in an elaborated manner in an elaborated manner so that you can understand this medicine very well. So first of all, so let's talk about scope of a aura neutronatum as a homeopathic medicine. So its first action is on the mind. So let's talk about the mind symptoms. The mental state of this medicine is a kind of claustrophobic with marked anxiety for the future. If these patients are hurt, then they will go into a state of deep depression, especially if they are hurt in love relationships or affairs. Along with depression, there will be loss of appetite and do, they do not care for themselves and want themselves to be in the same state. There will be a loss of sexual desires and, be, and becomes reserved and timid. This medicine is often recommended for the individuals who are experiencing symptoms such as depression, anxiety, fatigue, insomnia, palpitations, digestive issues and with loss of appetite. It is, it is believed to be particularly beneficial for those who are prone to feeling overwhelmed stressed or discouraged as it is a thought to promote a sense of inner strength, resilience and emotional stability. The next, the next action of Aurum Muratronatum is on the head. Let us talk about it. So this medicine can be prescribed for the patient who complains about boring pain in the vortex, temple and occiput. There is a wandering type of pain in the forehead and heaviness remains all day. It is a versatile homeopathic medicine for one-sided headaches and tension headaches especially. There is, there is distensive pressure in the temples which make the patient hold his head with both his hands. There is a vertigo and whirling before the eyes on every motion and tearing type of pain above the eyes that become worse by stooping and relieving in the open air. There is also a sensation of coolness on the top of the head. The next action of Aurum Unitronatum is on the eyes. Let's talk about it. So this is a very marvelous homeopathic medicine, which is to be prescribed in which is to be prescribed in treating eye complaints such as dryness of the eyes, twitching of the eyelids, vision-related problems, and eye infections. So this medicine can be given when a patient says there is a burning, pricking, and itching in the margins of the eyelids, and eyes seems completely dry. Also, there is a tearing pain that begins from the left eye and extends toward the right eye. There is a violent boring pain in the occip. In the, in the orbital bone when walking. 
there is a forcible and involuntary closing of the eyes by the violent boring of the violent boring on the frontal bone the next section of aurum urinator entum is on the throat so this medicine can be given when there is a stitching deep in the throat scraping in the fossas with copious flow of the saliva it is indicated medicine for painful swelling of the submaxillary gland and this medicine can be prescribed when patient says there is a scratching and pricking in the throat throat with pain in throat and difficulty in deglutition means in swallowing next section is on the chest so let's talk about it so this medicine has been recognized for its beneficial effect on respiratory health particularly in addressing symptoms such as frequent short dry cough bronchitis asthma asthma and other respiratory conditions there is a difficult respiration with anxiety and with the feeling as if there is a pressure on the chest and congestion of chest is also marked the patient complains about boring pain in the left wall of the thorax there is a seated pressure deep in the chest behind the sternum and extending into the back when walking this medicine is believed to help clear congestion so the inflammation and support overall respiratory functions next section of this medicine is on heart so it is a very beneficial medicine for the heart and for the heart and circulatory health it is often recommended for individuals who are experiencing heart palpitations high blood pressure and other serious issues so this medicine can be prescribed constitution wise when other symptoms of this remedy are matched with the symptoms of the disease individual along with irregular beating of the heart anxiety and shortness of the breath there is a rapid small irregular beats of the heart on slight motion with operation this medicine is believed to support the heart and circulatory system it promote healthy blood flow and help regulate heart rhythms it may also be used to address symptoms of anxiety or stress that manifest as physical discomfort in the chest or the heart region okay the next section of aurum urinatorum is on stomach or you can say gits so let's talk about it So this medicine is used to address symptoms such as indigestion, bloating, acidity, and other gastric issues. It is believed to help regulate digestive functions, promote healthy gut flora, and support overall gastric health. When a patient is inclined to vomit with nausea on an empty stomach after rising in the morning, then this medicine is prescribed. There is a violent gastritis, slow digestion, and vomiting of a clear water. This medicine is recommended when the patient complains about distress in the stomach after eating, and there is burning, stitching. gnawing and cutting pain in the stomach this medicine can also be used for balancing stomach acid levels soothe gastric inflammation and support the healing of the digestive tract of abdominal discomfort flatulence cramping cramping pain near the umbilicus constipation and diarrhea this medicine is very effective and it can be prescribed when there is burning in the hypochondrium swelling and inflation of the abdomen much flatulence with colic and a fluid and a fluid too This medicine can be prescribed when there is an appearance of hemorrhoidal tumors which protrude when defic when defecated and are very painful. There is a stitching pain in the anus while passing stool. The next section of this medicine is on the urinary tract. Let's talk about it. So this medicine is very helpful for the individuals experiencing UTIs, bladder irritation and urinary frequency. It can be prescribed when there is stitching pain at the end of the urethra. and the patient and, and the patient complains about difficulty while passing urine there is also cutting pain at the end of the urethra while urinating this medicine is effective in the cases of di diuresis frequent urination renal stones and utis and this medicine can also be prescribed when patient complains about sweating and burning pain in the urethra while urinating and the urine feels too hot So this medicine can be beneficial for men who are experiencing sexual health issues such as erectile dysfunctioning, low libido, and performance anxiety. This medicine can be indicated when the patient complains about the violent itching of the glands that make him awake at night. There is also growing pain along the spermatic cord, which comes in paroxysms. And this medicine is highly effective in cases of exhausting erections. also there is swelling and tension in the testicles the next next section of this medicine is on the female genitals so it is a very valuable homeopathic medicine for the female related disorders especially menstrual like menstrual irregularities hormonal imbalance menopausal symptoms lycoria fibroids 
uterus tumors. So let's talk about it. So it is a marvelous medicine for uterine and ovarian disorders such as ovarian cysts, uterine tumors, uterine cancers, endometriosis, and fibroids. It is mostly indicated to treat hard and indurated ovaries and cervix. So women who suffer from hormonal imbalances due to some mental stress, such as disappointment in a love relationship, grief, or death of any loved one, and later develop menstrual irregularities in their life, highly benefit from this medicine. Now the last section of this medicine is on skin. So let's talk about it. So this medicine is highly beneficial who are prone to develop who are prone to develop small red pimples or acne on their face that are painful to touch. It is also beneficial for cystic acne that develops due to hormonal imbalance or mental stress. And this can also be used for redness of the face due to sun sensitivity, carbuncles and boils on the skin. So these are the various indications where aurum mure natronatum can be used successfully. Now next we'll talk about the doses. So first we have is aurum mure natronatum 30. So lower potency is given when very few symptoms of patient match with match with this with this medicine and help the doctor only to diagnose the disease condition. Second, aurum mure natronatum natronatum 200. So this is considered as a higher potency and they are given when most mental symptoms and physical symptoms of aurum mure natronatum are matched with a diseased individual. And higher potencies are advised not to be repeated very often as they act for a longer duration of days. So the second dose is repeated every 7th or the every 15th day once. Next is aurum mure natronatum 1M. This is a very high potency of this medicine. So one should give it only after careful case analysis when all medicinal symptoms of this medicine and that given by the patient match perfectly one should not repeat 1m potency it is given 30 days once and waiting for the symptoms to disappear or until any new symptoms appear next is aurum mure natronatum 3x so this lower potency of this medicine works well in female genital conditions such as irregular menses, amenorrhea, menopausal symptoms and reduces the chronic inflammation of the uterus and prolapse of the uterus. It is also very effective in the cases of uterine tumors and fibroids, ovarian cysts and palpitations of young girls. In cases of painful contraction of the vagina and thick yellowish discharge on the vagina, this medicine can be prescribed. Is also helpful for treating skin conditions like acne, red, small pimples, boils, and carbuncles. And they are also given in cases of warts that appears on the tongue and genital areas. So in conclusion, I want to say that Aurum Muraticum Natronatum is a very versatile homeopathic medicine with a wide range of applications from cardiovascular to mental health to hormonal imbalances and, hormonal imbalances and musculoskeletal issues. Its holistic approach, approach and minimal side effects make it a valuable option in the realm of the natural medicine. Remember, it's essential to work with a qualified homeopathic practitioner to ensure you receive the most appropriate and effective treatment. That's all for today. If you find this video informative, helpful and especially valuable, so please give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe our YouTube channel and hit the notification bell for more insights into the world of homeopathy and natural healing. And thank you so much for joining me on this exploration of Aurum Mure Natronatum as a homeopathic medicine. So until next time, take care. See you guys in the next video. Till then, stay safe and stay healthy. And if you are suffering from any of the health issues, you can contact us for online appointments. So that's it for now. And thank you so much for watching this video.